Hey guys, Dana with Spun Paradise Cotton Candy. Super excited for this fall season and super excited to make jack-o'-lantern pumpkin, cotton candy pumpkins with you guys today. So I am using today our or certified organic pumpkin spice cotton candy sugar floss. Super delicious and spicy and all things fall and get yourself some. You can get it over on the website right now. Uh, we only offer pumpkin spice during fall time and then we'll have some other flavors for Christmas time and those are just fun seasonal flavors. All right, so just gonna putting some cotton candy in. Today I'm using the Carnival King and I have warmed this machine up for quite a while already today. So it's super hot and ready. With the pumpkin, I just love to make like a little fun wisp on top. Like it had its little vines. You could totally do anything. You could do a stem or whatever you want. I had some sugar paper left over from a Sweet Stuff, Stuff Napa. They did some custom eyes for me from another project so I just cut up some fun little shapes today to use as my jack-o-lantern faces I'm just using an edible brush um, for like cake decorating just a Wilton brand is what I'm using and then just some water just so you guys can see I'm gonna put down my pumpkin just for a minute I just brush a tiny bit of water onto the back of my paper To get it to stick it does not take a lot friends it does not take a lot at all these would be super fun to do if any of you are doing fall festivals like at pumpkin patches or Halloween events like so fun super unique the face is the eyes, everything, this paper is completely edible. So people can totally have fun eating everything. So here's just one example now, one that I did. So here's my first little guy, my first little jack-o'-lantern with his poofy vines. I say those are his vines. He was freshly picked, but super cute. And I'm gonna do one more, just so you guys can see the process one more time super simple I know all of you can totally do this and how fun especially like I said any fall events right now these will be such a hit The sugar just keeps going. Love it. You guys, I wish you could smell it. It really does smell so good. It just smells like fall and that makes my heart so happy. Okay, I'm not going to put vines on this guy or a stem. I'm just gonna keep them a little old circular pumpkin. And once again, I'm going to just use my water and my paintbrush, food safe paintbrush. takes so little. You guys, you could totally use instead of water, honey, agave. We have used all, you can really use anything. Um, but I like water. It's allergen friendly. Always safe with some water. Always. I am using some eyebrows on these. this one that were custom eyebrows we had done. I did not hand cut or cut these ones out won't take credit. These are custom eyebrows. Again, from the eyebrows were something that Sweet Stuff Napa on Etsy also made for us. And paint that on there. 
So cute. Okay, you guys. Check out those eyebrows. For real. I love them. Okay, so super simple. Again, super cute. You will get rave reviews doing these at pumpkin patches, fall festivals. It doesn't matter. Do them in your kitchen with your kids. So much fun. Get yourself some rice paper or some sugar paper and go to town, you guys. Have a fabulous fall, and as always, keep it sweet.